everyone, Bonaboy responded to her ex-girlfriend who come on live interview to say that Bonaboy impregnated her and her mother removed the pregnancy. Not just that, that they dated for three years and it was as a result of the pregnancy that ended up their relationship with um, Bonaboy. Okay, Bonaboy said, Meanwhile, this now one of the first people will call me impotent to and a 20k be her money that year. Normally, of which I give a more. I beg, enter the comment section if you know this girl that year and confirm if I did lie. Say na 20k be her money. <laughs> this guy is too funny. Or okay, I didn't even address the issue. Do you understand? This girl is, oh, it, it, okay, now, it is not clear that actually you really had something to do with her. And uh, she is saying that it was not once, it was not two, it was not three times. It is as repeated that you even used to come to her house to visit her. Oh, God, forget that you are now at the top. Don't think that uh, everybody does not have past. There is no one in this life that doesn't have a past. Yes, yeah, same way goes to all you politicians, all you musicians, all you billionaires today. You once had a past. You might be the type that was, you know, go begging people for money or for food in the past. Yes. There is no legend today without a past, but now, but that is something I want you to understand. Everything is not laughable. You don't even know the pain that this girl went through. Okay, let's say that this thing is true. Because for this girl to get the boldness to come on life and talk about this, do you think about her? Maybe she has enjoyed it a lot. That's okay. She not deemed it necessary to come at all. Although people are blaming her that why now? Why haven't she come all this way? Why now? She said that both of you dated for three whole years. And during the line, you guys had unprotected sex, which led to pregnancy. But your mother was the one that review, um, removed the child. And not just removing the child alone, but even warned her not to come around you any longer, which is um, her son. Do you understand? We are all human beings. And according to her, she said that she's not happy that... A woman like her, her fellow woman, did such thing to her. Bona boy, this girl that come here to talk about you, loved you, then wholeheartedly, but the way your mother maltreated her and treated the pregnancy made her, you know, to have an unending nightmare that probably led her to come on live podcast to say all these things concerning you. Everything is not laughable. Everything is not all about coming online to laugh about something. You are the one that uh, took um, Abby Spidalent to into court. Abby, to, you arrested him with Nigerian police. You take it, you put him in cell, locked him for three days, and the mother came online to cry that. That same way this girl is not happy of what your mother did. That same way she's not happy that her pregnancy, her baby got terminated by your mother. Sometimes you try to put yourself in the shoes of others to know how it pinched them. You coming online to say, eh, normally you know, that this girl where they collect it, them say I I they I be impotent today, no, that year. So you are not proving that you actually had something to do with her. You are not also proving that yeah, too little, too little she got pregnant for you, but it was terminated. Who knows? Maybe the child was and that is the reason why even your so called former girlfriend couldn't even give you a child throughout your relationship with her. But when you break up with her, you come online to say that she demands for sex. Sometimes she even asks you to fuck her for like seven times in a day. That your strength is not meant for sex, but for something else. There are some certain things that people will be doing. They say ignorance is a disease. Do you understand? Ignorance is a disease. You better look for a solution than, you better sort, a, sort, some, sort something immediately than afterwards trying to look for a solution. That is fact about life. So this girl um, dragging um, Bonner Boy yesterday, calling her Bonner Boy for impregnating her and her mother terminated the pregnancy, got replied by Bonner Boy. And Bonner Boy respond to this girl is, um, should I use this word laughable or comic? In the sense that you coming online to say that normally that this girl you pay 20k. Does, are you trying to tell us that she's a street or runs girl that you pays her 20k just to have your way? Are you trying to tell her that okay, you paid her 20k to have your way with unprotected, as in an un, to have your way unprotected without any CD? Is that how you go? Is that how you do it? If she's a runs girl, that means you aren't afraid to contact any disease. 
But this girl is telling her publicly that you are his boyfriend, that you are her boyfriend, that both of you have been together. We are together for three whole years, which led to pregnancy. You can't tell me a wrong girl that you have something, a non-protected state, more than five times to the extent of impregnating her. And you still have the guts to come online to talk ill of her and talk this that now 20 can be her money that year and you pay that you're not owing her. Guy, come off it. You are bigger than this. Do you understand? Anyway, this is Bonaboy's respond to her. And my own observation is that Bonaboy actually had something to do with this girl, but he doesn't know how to come on air, come out publicly to accept it. Rather, he used the way that now no matter that these people say being potent today, no. And say that 20 k be her money, and I know they owe her. Now, Bonner boys respond to this game. Anyway, my country people, what do you guys got to say concerning all this? Because the way things are happening in Nigeria, we all know that all these are attention diverse, you know, they are diversing Nigeria's attention. Recently, the cost of fuel has increased to 1,035 naira per liter, which is really a cause for alarm. So, I don't know why things are, you know, why these people are cutting our attention to unreasonable stuff. Don't forget to stay tuned for more of this. Christy TV got you covered. I love you guys.